Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Mad Games Tycoon. My name is Weasel, and we just bought the gigantic office building after Weasel Farm Tycoon made 340 million profit. It's crazy, and I just started building, and I figured, you know what? Let's do the office design in this episode. Um... We're not going to do any development or anything. We're just going to build up the giant office building. I'm going to plan it out and put office and furniture and designate everyone. Um, if you don't want to see that, you can pretty much skip to the next episode. Um, that is at least my plan. I don't know how long this is going to take. But yeah, um, we're just going to build this. And uh, I started with production. We're going to have two production facilities and a big storage room. That is the plan um, here. So we can produce two games at a time or do double, double speed. Um, because last time with our AAA title I did, I was not ready. Let's let's face it, I was absolutely not ready. So this time I want... I mean, that's like nearly a third of the building, or at least a fourth of the building is just production. And I really want to get into that. Um, we're going to fill this whole thing with storage containers. I mean, that's just crazy how much we'll be able to store in here. I think it's also going to be enough. Uh, that's just... Should I leave space? Yeah, I'm not going to leave space in between. I have no idea how they could possibly get stuff out of here. This is just ridiculously tight in here. But, I mean, hey, not my problem. Am I right? Wow. Yeah, we're going to have like a hallway in the middle. So that's something. And then they can play this like weird sliding game where you need to move things around to uh, complete the puzzle. I forgot what they're called. You pretty much just have like one tile without a puzzle piece and then you slide it around until you get it. Okay, how much does fit into this thing, into the storeroom? 10 million? Ooh, actually, I would love a few more in there. But, yeah, let's let's, let's fill up the whole room. <laughs> it's just crazy. Weasel, you're just crazy. This this, this can't be healthy. Um, this can't be safe, for that matter. Um, yeah, let's put a, vent, uh, a, a fan over there. And maybe a fire extinguisher. Just to be on the safe side. This thing is just crazy. A cheap ceiling lamp. Nah. But look at that hole. There's, there's plenty of space over there. Okay, this is just for storage. Uh, it's time to put the machines in here. And I'm going to make uh, sure that this time uh, it looks a little bit more professional. Um, right, no, we need a production machine. If we have plenty of production, I'm not too worried with a 10 million uh, inventory if we can produce um, stuff fast enough. It's going to be a space there. No, actually they fit perfectly. Yeah, I'm gonna place them across each other. That looks really neat. Man, that's 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 a lot of production capability right there. I'm excited to run these. That is a lot of production. We can fill up that space in like no time with these babies. All right, I think production is done. Um, just want to make sure. Let's put a fire extinguisher in there. It's always important to have those, and two fans. You know. Just to get the bad air out. I would probably put some windows in there or an actual AC system. But hey, who am I? Right? And maybe um, just to heat it up a little bit further. Because it's not can't possibly be warm in there. All right. Wow, look at that. That's exciting. Oh, we still have stuff. Oh, from Weasel Farm Tycoon. We have a few remainders. That game sold insanely well. Now we have plenty of space. And I definitely will keep some space for um, a server room which we will need for our MMO, what we're going to do. But for now, uh, we are going to put on all the office buildings. Actually, we're going to start with the staff room in the middle or so. Like a staff room in the middle and then buildings around it. How does that? I think that sounds awesome. Just like a big staff room. Um, let's start it like that. Very good. 11 by 16. That's that's plenty big. That's plenty big. Um by 50. Yeah, I don't want to overdo it, obviously. But, yeah, we can still build plenty of big rooms here. Uh, the entry is over here. And we're gonna put all the cool things in there. Pretty much we're gonna put one of everything into the staff room. Um, gaming machines, very important to put those in all the arcades. Um, can I zoom in a little bit? Yeah, I can. Um... Come on, let me... Yes. Much better, much better. Uh, a fridge right next to the gaming machine, so you can take out that nice, cool Coke. Uh, a modern fridge, just for regular food, I feel. Uh, ooh, couch. Okay, we're gonna do, like, um... Uh, let's put it over here, and maybe in the different colors, just to, like, mix it up a bit. Ooh, this looks nice. So, like, a talking group. I really dig this. I really dig this. Um... I feel I should do the same over here with those ones. 
Just distributing it a little bit because, let's face it, we have the space. We totally have the space. I'm gonna do it with two gray couches here. Just, you know, they can talk to each other when they want to. Oh, right, the big, big gray couch here on the side. Ah, gray does look horrible. Let's go with black. Giant black couch. Someone can sleep on there when it's late at night. A television. Oh, right. Um, Let's put one over here. And... Hmm... One to next to the fridge? Nah, one one will do the trick. We don't need too many. Oh yeah, right. Cola machine. Uh, a vending machine. Anything else in there? Actually, there's not too many things we can put in here. That's a little bit annoying. Guess I'm going to have to space this out a bit more. Here you go. I mean, there's plenty of other items we can put in here. The more general purpose, like plants. Yeah, let's put some plants in here. Just make it look nice. Um, trash cans, absolutely. We should always have trash cans around. What about a water cooler? Not everyone wants a soda. Uh, fire extinguisher, always important to have those. Should probably designate that stuff later. Ooh, a sound system! Absolutely. For dancing. Here, you can have like, you can dance. Um, over here. It's like the dance floor. Oh man, pictures, lots of pictures. Nah, we're just going to put some proper lamps in here. An expensive lamp. <laughs> Sorry, I'm taking my time to design this. I just think this is ultra cool to do. There's a lot of fun. Some nice pictures on the wall. Yeah, why not? There needs to be game posters in the game that you can uh, designate yourself and... Very well. Um, maybe another fan over them. Mm, do we see anything else that we wanted here? Uh, yeah, a pin board. Like a big pin board so people can like leave notes and trade stuff. I don't know. Right over the couch. That's practical, Weasel. No, it's not. It's totally not. This is a big staff room. Like a really, really big staff room. I don't even know what to do with the rest of here. I mean, we can always put in more chairs. People people have been complaining that they don't have enough chairs. So, here. Uh, orange chair and a blue chair. I'm going to build everything. A gray chair. Um, yeah, red designer chair. I won't mind that. Here, you can talk to each other. Man, ugh. A cow chair. Which is, it's, it's, it's chair collector 2015. Nah, I think I think the room is is, is, is done. The the staff room. That's a really cool staff room. Proud of that. Alright. Uh, I think it's time to get a toilet going. Important to have that too. Just maybe a small one over there. And again, I want to build a development office. Eh, let's throw that one over here. One toilet. And we need some stalls, toilet stalls. At this point, I feel I could just put marble everywhere. Put some space in between for some extra privacy. God, this is gonna be big. Glad you guys enjoy. Uh, decided to join me building this. Okay, some sinks. I feel they should be at the exit, not at the start. But uh, I'm gonna put it on both sides. And hand dryer in the middle. Hand dryer left and right. Good enough. And, oh man, luxury sinks. I should have put those in instead of like the ugly ones. You know what? I still can do that. I still can put the lux uh, luxurious ones in. I don't see the other thing. Can I turn? Ah, okay. I just got it like that. All right, give me the luxury sink because we clearly can't afford it. Uh, can I squeeze one here? And nope, doesn't fit. What a shame. By the way, they're ugly as balls, so I don't want them. But I will take the expensive sink instead. Looks more like a bathroom sink, to be honest. With like a storage capacity below there. Ah, whatever. That's quite all right. I think that'll do the trick. You don't need that many. All right, uh, toilets are done. Next, I think we should actually start with the proper rooms. Um, development, right. Okay, we need a big development office, but I feel we need at least two or so. Um, I mean, one big dev office over here should do the trick. Then some QA, some studios over here and there. Even though this office feels a little gigantic. Let's do, let's, let's stay with one office. Yeah, that's, that's the proper size. I'm gonna make it this size. So the entry from the dev office into the store, um, Staff room is right above, uh, over there. Then, research. Not as important anymore. Not as important, but uh, QA, actually quite important. QA, quality assurance. I want two QA rooms, actually. 
So I'm going to splice them up. One for bugs. Yep, like that. Door goes over there. And one for um, the researching, uh, adding additional features to the game. So we're actually going to have two of those. Uh, we're going to furnish them once we put out the layout. Oh, man. Okay, quality assurance that is done. I think... Hmm... Let's put the other development rooms there. Music studio, I would love that over here. Uh, yeah, like a big one. Well, yeah, that is, that is plenty, plenty big. And maybe a graphic studio right over there. Yeah, they're, they're, they're really big studios now. Um, yeah, let's, let's make a two wide hallway. I mean, it might be a little bit of a waste, but it looks nicer. Okay, we got our sound studio. Hmm. Now we need our graphic studio, or whatever it's called. Oh, mocap. Still, we don't have mocap. We're going to have to remember that. Anyway, um, training room graphic studio, right next to the audio studio, right over here, next to each other. Ah, oh, this is going to be great. I'm so excited for this. Mocap. Man, why, what do I need to get mocap? Let's see. That's probably under the unlocks. Um, not an early access. Oh, okay. So that's going to come with the full release of the game. That would explain it. Teasing me, game. You're teasing me. Why are you doing this to me? Okay, customer support also equally important now. Um, I think that's that's plenty big. I also want marketing, obviously. Marketing, yeah, that's, that's plenty big. We don't need a, a giant marketing department. Customer support, we have that. Research, on the other hand, is super important, but I will also keep it small because we pretty much got everything. I mean, we just got some topics and maybe here and there, there is going to be the one or two things that we need to research um, in terms of topics. But other than that, not really, not really the need. A training room, on the other hand, would be a really cool thing. I figure we can, we should have a big training room. I'm gonna separate that and I wanna be able to train the whole office. Just throw everyone in there and train them with everything for a while. <laughs> That sounds amazing. Mm. Yeah, let's throw it next to the toilets. Like like this. This is this is giant, I think. Gigantic. This is this is plenty big. Plenty big. So what we'll do. Yeah, that's fine. Any other rooms that I would need right now? I don't feel so. Um always could use a de sec second development building. Um development room, but mm, I think we're fine without it for now. Head office. Oh man. Big head office. Big head office because that's for me. That's that's mine. <laughs> right next to production. Great weasel. Great, great, great job there. <sighs> we have a staff room. Server room, really important. I think I'm going to get one uh, already. Just preparing for the future. It's the last thing that I need, right? Customer support, head office, research. Yeah, I got everything. So time for a big server room. And that server room, ugh, we'll squeeze that over here. Just a small, smallish server room. Well, we can also do it like that. Like, elongated like this. Oh. Maybe a little smaller, just to have, like, the hallway still. Ah, we don't need a big hallway here. This is uh, for production. <laughs> However, they're gonna ship out these giant pallets. That's not my problem. Maybe there's another door here at the windows. Who knows? Anyway, this is the server room. Player capacity. Well, we can always upgrade later on. But for now, having a small server room is nice. All right. So let's go ahead and fill the rooms with furniture. We're going to furnish all of this. We're going to, of course, go for the best of the best. Because we have, like, nearly half a billion... Over half a billion. Um, all right. Desk development research. Of course, the super pricey vault desk. In, uh, I'm going to go with gray or white. Man, the choices. I think I'm going to go with white here. White sounds really nice. And... Yeah, everyone faces the wall, so you don't have to stare on each other's screen. I never like that. If you, someone could like look on your screen while you're working, it's quite obnoxious. Okay, some furniture over here. Okay, I'm gonna space this out a little bit. Oh, actually, I could have moved you over there. Well, let's move you over there. Wall desk gray. Nope, nope, nope. White. We're gonna stick stick with white. Um. This is not working as I thought it would. Let's sell this again. 
I definitely want to put a lot of stuff in here. But I think, we're, yeah, we're going to put it on the outside, just like in the last office, and put items that they would want or need in the middle. Man, it must suck to have the wall space. You got to, like, squeeze through everyone. It's not, not, not the smartest way. And, of course, the supervisor sits at the end. <laughs> the team lead, I don't know. Okay, that's, that's, that's plenty big, but I think we can even squeeze a few more peeps in here. God, this room must be so hot. And I would like... Another couple to sit here. Yeah, let's throw another one in there. This office is gigantic. I mean, how many? 31 people fit in here. Wow. Okay, we can remove this and make this an even 30. That makes me happy. Okay. We're going to keep going this time with gray, I think. In, um, that's QA. QA is going to get gray desks. We do not have too many space in everyone, though. Oh, I'm actually surprised how tight this actually is. Okay, this could just be for bugs, and this could be just for um, research. Um, uh, QA for improvements, so I will get some gray smaller desks into this building. Let's go white. This should be for bugs, the other one should be for improvements. That's nearly the same amount of desks that I can fit in here. So not really that big of a difference. Five versus eight. Okay, our music studio needs to be uh, the modern sound studio. How many can I squeeze in here? Probably not too many, just like in the last office. Eh, four. Actually, I can squ eh, I can put the fifth one in the middle, but you know what? I will just go with four. That's totally fine. And the graphic studio, we should be able to squeeze quite a few more in here. One, two, three. Uh, this is, yeah, this will work. Mm. Ow. Okay. Let's move this one a little bit into the middle of the room. Let's move this over here to balance it out. Looks good. Looks good to me. Looks very good to me. They're now sitting in the middle. Six people. Four people. Audio. I'm, I'm, I'm not crazy. The rest is just going to sit in development. At least we can work a little bit here. I guess those could have been bigger, but... Ah, it's fine. Time for the head office. We're gonna get, of course, our... Oh! You have to unlock more. Right, that is probably... The crystal cheer. <laughs> A crystal desk. Yeah, that is for... I don't like marble desks, but it's worth it. Um, cabinet. Who has left you open? Throw them all in there. Some nice desks. Uh, let's crease one over here. Oh, I like this office. Do I need anything else in here? I guess I could put a nice orange designer chair in here if you want to talk to me. Um, yeah, I think we're good. Do we even need to assign someone to the head office, like Weasel? I don't even know if we need... It doesn't seem there's, there's a slot to designate. Okay, training room. Training room. I will squeeze in as much as I can with the nice black desks, which is probably going to be quite a lot, uh, which was also the intention, so... Oh yeah, we can we can squeeze a lot of people in here, and then train all of them. It's gonna be fantastic. Okay, this is really a lot of people, and of course we should have a blackboard hanging somewhere. Let's let's put two blackboards here, and um, that's good. Server room haven't built that yet. That's interesting. Let's see what we can fit in there. There's probably different servers, like a core server. Servers are required to host the MSOs. This server can hold up to 250,000. Twin server, I am totally gonna get a core server for 500,000. I'm gonna squeeze, we're gonna just the best of the best of the best. I don't even need servers right now. The good thing is I think they don't um, get old, so you don't need to, wow, this is pricey. Um, so you don't need to upgrade them, I think. Maybe we need to upgrade them. We'll see. Maybe there's going to be an option for that. There should be one, I feel. Okay, one, two, three. Meaning I can... Yeah, I don't need to squeeze more over there. Uh, we're going to build it like this. This this, this will do the trick. Flipping it around like that. Um, this is going to host a lot of people. If we have an MMO that runs like this, I'm going to be quite happy. Look at this server room. How many does that host? 7.5 million. Actually, not that, not as many as I would think. Oh well, it's a big server room. If we need it bigger, we will get there. Okay, time to add the last tables. I think I'm gonna go with the smaller ones um, for 
um, all the other departments. I mean, even though I like this other stuff for customer support, you know what? We don't we don't even have that many people for customer support. So I might as well get the good desks for them because I wouldn't want to do the job. I wouldn't want to necessarily deal with angry customers. So let's get them good desks just to make their life less miserable. Can I squeeze more desks in here? It's super tight, but I got quite a few in there. Same with marketing. Might as well give them a few nice desks. I'm going to go with the same layout here as next door. And which one was that? That was research. Uh, research, since we're not going to keep them in there all the time. You know, maybe, maybe one of these booths. Yeah, that looks cool. <laughs> How in the hell are they going to get out of there? I don't think they are. Okay, six people in research. That's quite a ride. I don't think we need more. Uh, we definitely built up this uh, uh, place. Let's uh, decorate it a little bit more. Make sure that they have all the things I would want. For example, a Knork cabinet in white. Let's put two cabinets over here. Cabinet! And maybe a white one over here. A bully. Um, I think some cool chairs in here would be nice. Uh, or at least one chair. <laughs> Heating! I totally forgot about heating. Definitely every room should have heating. That's quite important. Including my office and the staff room. Two in the staff room, one in the toilet. You don't want to freeze wire when you take a dump. That would really... that would really suck. Oh, that was the wrong room, Weasel, and now we have three in there. Why can't I get one? Ah, whatever. Well, you gotta freeze. <laughs> That's just what happens. Okay, you get a... you get a radiator. You get a radiator. Everyone gets a radiator. Even the server room gets a radiator. Oh, that's a horrible idea, Weasel. Don't put a radiator in the server room. Idiot. Okay, trash cans. Absolutely. Here, trash can. I'm gonna make this look real nice. Oh, man, that's, a, that's such an awesome studio. I feel we should also put some plants everywhere. Just to, to keep morale high. It's like they can, they can name it. Every room can name their plant. And the one that dies, the people will get kicked. No, just kidding. You will be booted because your plant died. That sounds really horrible. Okay, they were always complaining about needing a copier, so I'm going to give them, uh, I think, two straight out of the bat, maybe? If I can fit it somewhere nicely. Yeah, there you go. Two copiers. What else did you want? You want a, a fire extinguisher. We do not want a lawsuit, because we didn't have a fire extinguisher. Definitely should have them in production, both of them. Oops, excuse me. And in the server rooms. All the fire extinguisher in the server rooms. There's not really fires in this, but I'm just saying... W wouldn't hurt. Air, air, van, uh, air fan. Ceiling fan, not air fan weasel. All fans are kind of air fans, aren't they? Didn't put fans on here. Okay. One in the toilet to, like, mix up the flavors. <laughs> okay. Other than that, I am really happy with this. I'm really happy. Now it comes to designating people. Man, so many people. Can I just... Just select them all, just all of them. Probably not. This is gonna take a bit. I will throw in the best graphic artist and the best sound artist into these studios, and then the rest ah, into there. Maybe do some, uh, you know, training. Who knows? But uh, in any case, I hope you guys enjoyed building this room, this office up. We're gonna continue developing and making cool new stuff in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. I'm Weasel. I'm out, and I hope to see you around. Bye bye.